A community still mourning over the disappearance of this five year old girl, Oakley Carlson. So tonight, people are going to hold a candlelight vigil outside of Oakville Elementary. The search is expected to continue today for Oakley. We know crews are focusing the search around the home and around 300 acres around it. Authorities don't have an exact time frame of when Oakley went missing, but her parents claim she was alive the last time they saw her. Sheriff deputies say they are uncooperative beyond that. Investigators are now looking into a fire that happened at their home last month. A GoFundMe account was set up by a friend of the couple showing damage to the, the home. Uh, the friends claiming that the parents didn't call 911 because they couldn't find their phones. Oakley's former foster mom calling the Department of Children, Youth and Families right before Thanksgiving when she saw that GoFundMe account. If nobody has seen her, like, what could have happened to her? Was it the fire? Was it something else? So we reached out to the department, but they said they cannot make any comments. The Grace Harbor Sheriff's Office says if you have had contact with Oakley in the past year, just give them a call. So while we wait for more answers, we did some digging into whether the state failed to protect Oakley. The state agency that investigates the complaints of abuse and neglect within the child welfare system, the director of that says it can be a tricky balance to protect children within the system. The harm from leaving the child in a uh, possibly kind of neg neglectful or abusive situation in the home, in the family's home, versus the trauma of removing the child and the separation from the parent and possibly siblings. The director can't specifically comment on Oakley's case, but he says when a child enters state care, the primary goal is to eventually reunite them with their parents. And he says that involves providing families the opportunity to engage in services that address issues that caused the separation from their children in the first place.